Hi, it's Jennifer from Soul Source Tarot, and I'm here to do your daily vibes for around July 3rd. You know, the timing is fluid, so in this reading may or may not be for you. Let's just see what comes up. I'm going to do another segment starting tomorrow for the week ahead, um, so stay tuned for that. I think I'm going to do it you and the other person. Maybe it's, yeah, it's a you and the other person spread that I'm going to do for the week ahead for each 12 signs. So, yeah, that I, that's what I'm going to do tomorrow. I'm going to do it all day, so I'm going to try to get all 12 of them done tomorrow. I'm trying something new. So, let's see what we got. What do we got? What do we have? You know, considering we're stuck home, you know. Independence Day is coming in. So much for Independence, right? I mean, we got some, but not much. Can't even go to fireworks, at least not where I live. They've even taken that away. They've taken away the fireworks. They've taken away the parades. Um, the the, the uh, Independence Day, it really doesn't feel like it's Independence Day. feels like it's... Uh, government day I don't know what would we call that please please put a comment below on what we should call this July 4th what 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 could we rename this July 4th because it sure the hell doesn't seem like Independence Day nine of swords and the world card so much for celebrating our independence, right? Anyhow, the world card. That is a completion of a cycle. Here we have uh, anxiousness. It's not. It's not really anxiousness. It's a. This is like a oh my god kind of energy. Is this is despair. This is some sort of despair. We have somebody that is in despair. This is this is a little bit overwhelming. It's too much. The next card is the Ten of Swords. We have an owl coming in, which is change. So change is coming in. Now, the next card is the Ten of Swords, which is the death of a situation. We have somebody that has reached the end. It's like, I can't do this anymore. I can't do this anymore. And change is coming in. The owl is a symbol of death. And it is a symbol of change. So we have a very... Uh, this is person is like in a desperate situation. Okay? They are. They've probably been alone for a while. Um, they've probably been praying. This person's been praying for a resolution. They've been having a hard time sleeping at night. It's been very stressful. Um, they've been stuck in a situation and they've reached the point where they just don't want to do this anymore. I just, I'm ready for a change. And it's like the universe hears their prayers and closure is coming because change is coming. When you see an owl, you can expect something to end. That's a transformation, okay? There's a transformation coming. There's an ending. There's a change that is coming, okay? It's a good change, okay? It's going to change your circumstances. And this is, here it is, okay? This is a new beginning. It's that phase of, that phase of life where you've been so stressed out and uh, begging for mercy by the looks of things. I mean, this is like begging. It's like, please just let this end. Okay, it's about to end. Looks like it is about to end. The stress is about to end. Uh, the despair is about to end. Whatever it is that you've been uh, stuck on or wallowing about or worried about or depressed over or whatever the case is, it's about to end. Okay, it is. Change is coming in, and it's coming in really, really, really fast. Okay. Um, this is a new life. A big phase is ending. That is something very prominent. When the world card comes up, you've, you've come a long ways. You've learned some sort of lesson. You know, somebody has learned a lesson. Okay, it's time to leave the past behind. It's time to get up off, off out of this situation and step into a new cycle. So a new chapter is about to begin. Somebody has reached the end of the journey. If this stressful situation is coming to an end. Period. It is. It is. Um, 
We have a new beginning here with that world card. There could be a change of residence as well. Okay? It could be a change of residence. This is also traveling. Um, going with the flow. Being in total balance. Um, it's like a whole new era is about to begin with the world card. And I would say that all, everything that is happening now, it's interesting that I started this out with Independence Day, is going to... Um, oh, God, my mind just went blank. Completely blank, too. I hate it when that happens. Affect 2021. 2021 is going to be completely different, put it that way. But I think we, what I think, and I'm not talking about the cards right now, based from my intuition, and the owl is a symbol of the highest intuition, okay? It's a symbol of very high intuition, okay? Highly, highly, highly intuitive. Somebody that is very wise and intuitive, okay? So I feel that we are going to experience this bullshit, until September of 2021. Just saying. I think we are. I think I don't think it's going to get complete that this 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 whole crapola that we're going through. I think it's going to continue to go on until then. I do feel that after the election things will will smooth out, but it won't be completely over until September of 2021. That's my guess. That's my intuition. That's what my gut tells me. But for this reading today, there is something in your life, because we're talking about independence. Independence is one, right? It's one. So we're talking about you. Or, well, as we're talking about you. So there is something that you have been stressing over that you have been worried about, that has been causing you uh, despair, that has reached the end of its cycle. Seven of Swords. Seven of Swords. Now, the seven, this is a different deck than the one I used yesterday. This Seven of Swords is a little bit different than the one I used yesterday. Just a little tiny bit. So it's the same guy. This is the same guy or the same person. Um, he's got something in his sights. He does. He has something in his sights. I feel as though this one's leaving though. He's taking a swift look back. He's looking back, but he's going in a new direction. Interesting. He is, because it feels like he's going up the steps this time. We used this deck yesterday. He's going up the steps this time. Interesting. I just want to see that. I just want to see that card. Hold on. I just want to, I just want to see that card. One second. Oh, yeah. Okay. Okay, so here, here he's, he's uh, getting away, okay? He's getting ready to leave or something, you know? Okay, he's getting ready to leave. Here, he's actually got his foot on the step. Okay, he's leaving. He is leaving. He's got what he wants. Here, here the swords are on the ground. Okay, here they're up. So he's picked them up. He's got what he wanted and he's leaving. He's leaving. So interesting. Something is about to happen. Something he's leaving. He's he's taking one look back. And usually with the world card, she's looking over her head, okay? She's looking back and she's saying goodbye, okay? This is saying goodbye. Somebody is saying goodbye. And there is, this guy, this person is leaving a stressful situation. This person, and I'm saying guy because it's on the card, but it certainly could be a female. This guy could be leaving a female. The female could be leaving him, whatever. Okay, we have somebody here that is leaving a stressful situation. They're leaving it. They got what they wanted. Something like that. Stepping into a new life. 
new beginning oh now this is heaven the star is heaven it's it's uh, a blessing now this is help arriving after the tower falls so that this comes after a tower moment so there is going to be a tower moment because the star comes after a tower moment okay so there's going to be a tower moment I don't need the tower card this card tells me there's going to be okay or there has been because the star, this is help arriving after the downfall, after the poor health, after the disruption, after the shock, after whatever happens. This is help arriving. So something is going to happen that causes a an ending. Okay, this is an ending. But help is arriving. It's a blessing. This is a blessing in disguise. It really is. So this is a dream come true. This is a wish being granted. This is this is heaven. Okay? This is protection. This is a renewal. It's also blending, healing. So this is a new beginning. It's a blessing. Whatever has happened over here, this person leaving is actually a blessing. It's a blessing because this is a new journey, a new chapter. Now, this this star is um, a wish being granted. And this is like wishing here. I just want it to be over with. Remember, I think I said that at the beginning. Well, your wish, whoever's been praying for this to be over with, well, your wish is about to be granted. Things are going to change fast with that owl. Owl, they are. This person is has made up their mind. They're taking a new approach. They're headed out. They may be moving. They're going somewhere. They got everything they need. They're out. They're leaving. Okay. This this uh, this this is over. They they've got. they it's done. Okay. This is done. This is a blessing. This happened for a purpose. Four of Pentacles. Now this is stability. Security. Holding on. Somebody was obsessed with holding on. This is a very, I mean, the Four of Pentacles is usually somebody that is very greedy, very selfish, very focused on money and things and assets. Somebody was holding on for fina because of financial stability. That's the only reason they were hanging on. Very greedy and selfish. But this is, uh, there's going to be a tower moment. Hmm. A new purpose of some sort. This person was holding on. But they this is a lesson learned. Somebody has learned a lesson. And they this is about deception. Perhaps they were deceived. They were lied to. They were cheated on. Because a lesson has been learned here. It has. It's obviously been a difficult journey. Okay, lesson has been learned. There's been some lies. There's been some deception. There may have been some cheating. There's been a betrayal of some sort. That was the tower moment. But there's help arriving or something like that. Oh, what the hell is this? Ooh, wish fulfillment again. Both these cards are cards of having it all. A wish being granted. Somebody's wish is about to be granted. This is a new beginning here. We, this is very arrogant, though. And this is having it all, having a lot of possessions next to this card. So we 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 do have somebody that has is learning a lesson about possessions. Just saying. This could be a new purpose, and this is seeing the light. You see the light right here. Okay, somebody may have seen the light, and they have some sort of regrets. You know, somebody may have some regrets over the lies, over the deception, over the betrayal. This is a new purpose. It is.
This is this is having it all. This is somebody who's like, oh, look at me, look at me. Seriously. Oh, look at me. Take a look at that. Look at me. Let me just put that in the glass or something like that. So we have somebody here that is very arrogant, that is very greedy and selfish. But I feel as though there's some sort of hmm, ending to that because of that world card. Ooh. Uh, bad news. Somebody's getting some bad news. Not good news. They're getting bad news or they're being shut down. Somebody could be being shut down. Perhaps that's their uh, karma. I mean, I don't see karma here, but this Eight of Wands has stopped. Uh, there, there's definitely, or they're getting blocked, or they were blocked. This is feeling guilty. Somebody made some poor choices. They made some poor choices. Now we got seven cups here. Somebody made some poor choices based on looks, based on, you know, materialistic things. Now they're being shut down or they're getting ill or something like that. Ooh, talked about choices just a minute here, just a minute ago. There's been some sort of blocked communication Maybe somebody was blocked because of their poor choices. But now there's this is an this is this could be a reunion or a new opportunity. This is a choice see Cupid's arrow and this is a wish being granted. Two people are being brought together that are a perfect match here. This is somebody's wish being granted. After being deceived though, this person has been in a state of desperation. They've been sad they have you know and alone this is lonely when you see a person with a light it reminds me of the hermit so somebody this person's been sad and alone and moping and whatever well that that's over with okay that's over with we have somebody here that is about to this person's made up their mind they've made up their mind they're about to step into the light okay they're about to step into the light they're about to step into the picture this is like a fairy godmother right here and this is cupid's arrow it's like they're or an angel or something that is bringing somebody uh they're about to connect somebody with their perfect match they are this is a perfect match. Somebody was holding on to something else just for stability. But that's it's come to an end or it's coming to an end. I think it's come to an end already or it's about to come to an end. Something has happened that caused a person's evolution and got this person ready to come together with their soulmate. This is a soulmate. Okay? This is a... Uh, Perfect, perfect, perfect match. Okay. So we have somebody here that... Uh, also may have been very obsessed with their money that they just didn't notice that there was this person. But they're going to see it. They're going to see it very clearly. It's going gonna, it's gonna to be very clear. So a wish is about to be granted. This person is it's like it feels like it's it's uh when you look into this person's eyes you just know it's so easy, it's perfect, there's no a disharmony at all. It's complete harmony, it's a complete love. It's a healing love. That's what it is. It's a healing love. It's it's an alignment. It's falling in love. It's like love at first sight. That's what I wanted to say too. It's love at first sight. So this is a dream come true. This is a this is this is. This is and it's unexpected because this is unexpected help arriving. 
that brings this is unexpectedly it's an unexpected union I don't feel like there's there's been no communication there's been you haven't communicated with this person or there's been a lack of communication now this is very stubborn energy Ooh, six of wands now this guy's done fighting the battle is over he's 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 ready he's been told as well probably egged on by his his people or you know his family his friends whoever's watching there also could be some public recognition here we could have somebody here even that is famous because a star could be famous this is public rec recognition and this is public recognition so there could be some public recognition here that is coming this is a hero this is a savior this is somebody who has been through a battle they have reached the end of the battle they're done playing games they're done with the competition they're ready they're ready they're ready to just settle down this person is coming in they're looking for victory right they're, this person has already proved themselves very noble very stable as well noble and stable definitely sees because wands are visions sees an opportunity been through some sort of sorrow himself this person has been through something uh, maybe this person was cheated there's there's some sort of deception here that has caused a person's evolution this person's been waiting and waiting and waiting. What's well, about to come in fast? Somebody is about to come in fast. This person has already done, 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 done playing games. There's some sort of travel here as well. It's almost like this person travels to the area. There may be some sort of distance this person may live a ways away and there's some sort of distance, but they're coming for some reason. And this is love at first sight. I know that it is. Ooh, Wheel of Fortune reversed now. But you, you know, maybe you may have met this person at the wrong time. You met this person at the wrong time and maybe now it's time. This could be something coming back around. But this is also, I mean, the Wheel of Fortune refers to some sort of setback, bad luck, bad timing. Something that didn't work out is coming back around. I don't know what it is. There's definitely somebody coming in that is very noble. They have good intentions. This is somebody that you asked for, okay, you wished for. This is wish. This is a wish being fulfilled, a wish being granted. Uh, it's the end of suffering. It's the end of loneliness. Um, there's been a lack of communication, but here it comes, okay? It, it's coming, it is coming. Maybe maybe this person didn't communicate because the person they they were dealing with was so arrogant because there is some sort of arrogance here materialism but anyway this is a soulmate connection okay get prepared for an arrival all right get prepared something is about to arrive that you've been waiting for Up. Somebody has been focused on a loss. They've been crying. They've been wallowing. Missing an opportunity for love. Pouting. But I feel as though now they are done. They're done. They're done with the soaking. I think that they're ready for their new life. 
They're, they're walking up those steps. They're done. And maybe this is self-deception. Maybe they've been cheating themselves of a new life. Anyhow, with the Three of Pentacles reversed, that's a uh, lack of togetherness, a need to refocus. There's been a lack of harmony with others. And there's been a lack of harmony with others because somebody was moping so much. But I feel like it's over, change. It's like it's time, it's time. Somebody was, was refusing to step into their new life, but it's over. It is definitely over. Somebody is going to come in that is going to change all of that. And it's going to happen very suddenly, out of the blue. Um, but where? Where does this person come from? I think this person is at a distance. I don't know why. Ooh, Queen of Pentacles, King of Pentacles reversed. Um, King of Pentacles reversed is very materialistic. Where does this person come from? Not the bank. <laughs> Uh, where does he come from? He's probably not rich. He's stable, but he's probably not rich. He's not all about money. He may not have a lot to offer financially, but he's he's noble. He or she. tower reverse now this is a permanent loss and this is I, would, I didn't say it this is a shocking uh, unpredictable loss and this is a permanent loss this person comes in after some sort of tower moment that's where he comes from he or she comes to help and that's how you meet him him or her this person comes to the aid, and that's how you meet this person. It's not through your job. It's not through your work. It's not through the bank. This person is coming to help clean up of some sort, or is coming uh, to some sort of get-together. And they come from afar. It's after a loss. It is. There's some sort of loss that brings this person in. I don't think you've communicated with this person yet. I think it's all of a sudden. I think it's somebody that you don't know. Good luck.